this isn't going to be as jolly and festive as a play that you might expect from a kid's night. So, because of that, I suggest you get up from your seats and walk away before I'm forced to tell you this tragic tale. I see you guys have decided to stay. That's all right. That brings us to the, chief, the home of the chief of police, James Smith. He is bringing home some guests. Meanwhile, one of the detectives, Adam, is having a midnight rendezvous with his wife. Although it seems like he has some malicious intent. Wow, Detective Adam, arrested just like that. Confusing, right? You want to know what happened before that? This, I'll bring you back to where the story all began. The, the, police, the police office. Where some police officers are working on a case.
I have shown you the past, and I have shown you the present. Now what happens after Detective Adam gets arrested? Well, unfortunately for little homewrecking Adam over here, he has to stay in jail for a long time. He is left wondering, what really happened that night? I... Get off me! I swear I was framed! Shut up! God, cops are right. Shut up, you're basically a cop. How did you get here? You're such a right? Well, I've told you guys a million times I'm innocent. We're all innocent. God. Oh my! Adam! Eve? Come on, you have to believe me. I was framed. I'm innocent. I'm not supposed to be in here. Then why am I in here in the first place? Because of what? Because you're getting too close. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry? That, that girl, you're getting way too close to the big What are you trying to say? Somebody. He's right, you did kill somebody. I agree, except ruining a marriage is also really, really bad. No, 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 no. Very unfortunate for Adam over here. I could not imagine how it would feel to get framed and spend the rest of my life in jail for something I did not do. Now here is the very important moral of the story. Remember kids, don't murder!